All right, welcome back to our channel. Today I wanted to try something. Um, since we moved to Vegas, I haven't really had a good shoe place that I go to. But a few of my shoes are getting super dirty. And they need some care. So I just wanted to get a before video. Before taking, I'm gonna take this and this today to the cleaners that I found with uh, really good reviews on Yelp. So I will be showing you the before shot of these, which is right now. And once I bring them back, I will show you the after and let's see how it comes out. All right, we had a slight change of plans. Uh, the place we were gonna go to turns out that um, while we were on the way there, the reviews actually were not that good and a lot of people had some high-end shoes that got damaged. So I'm gonna have to just do it the old school way and make my mix of toothpaste, baking soda, and warm water and try to clean this up myself. Got my valleys and my products here that are super dirty. So, uh, let's give it a shot. This one got some stains, very dirty on the bottom. Let's see how well we can clean this up. All I did again was toothpaste, baking soda, 
about one to one, and then I added a little bit of warm water to it, uh, mixed it up until it became a little paste, and I added a little baking soda if it was a little too watery, but that's it. And I think the key thing is making sure you wipe it down with a damp uh, cloth, just so you get all the stains out completely and you don't leave any water on your high-end leather sneakers. Um, but yeah, again, I wanted to go drop them off at this place that I found on Yelp, but while we were going there, we looked further into the reviews and there was a lot of people who, I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't believe everything I see on Yelp because we used to be business owners too and we know how customers can get with their bad reviews, trying to uh, get something extra or if they left unhappy about something that they feel they deserved, um, you know, negative reviews come too easily now. However, I did see a few reviews that looked legit and people were saying, you know, they dropped off their high-end shoes and they weren't the same after and they, the place didn't want to take responsibility for it. So again, I just did, did the old school toothbrush, toothpaste, baking soda and water method and um, I gotta say, I was here maybe what half an hour and I'm satisfied with the results. That's more than good enough for me for these like, that I've had for a long time. So yeah, if, if in case if you were wondering if uh, this works, there's your results right there. Um, is there anything else? No, I think that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to send me a message. Until next time, it's David. Thank you very much.